Here we are, beautiful Michigan winter wonderland. My wonderful trampoline. Did a great thing with this trampoline. I put a barrel up underneath the center of it so I didn't have to take the top off of it. I get tired of doing that. So I put that barrel out and it works pretty good. It fills up with snow, no problem. We're getting all kinds of snow here in Michigan. Everything's covered with snow. You know what I've got? I've got my old plow truck. That's about five degrees right now. It's a bit chilly. I just, what do I want to show you? My faithful old plow truck. Snow is terribly deep here. Gotta walk through all this snow. Uh, what I've done with this plow truck, this is old 88 Ford with a 351 motor. This is the most faithful truck. It gets all cold and everything starts, but the only thing problem with this truck is I had the uh, 2G series alternator on this truck. It's like a 65 amp 2G. You can tell the 2G because it's got two plug-ins that go to it. And I had a lot of trouble with it. And about four years ago, I upgraded this to the 3G series. This is a 200 amp 3G. When I had the old 2G on here, I couldn't run my lights, I couldn't plow at night, I couldn't do anything, I couldn't run my wipers or barely could run my heater, had all kinds of trouble with it. And then uh, I went to the 200 amp 3G series and boy there's no trouble, I can run my orange light, I can run my heater, I can run my headlights, I can plow at night, I can just run everything and it just works great. And uh, uh, what I had to do to adapt this in here, because the 3G body is just a little bit bigger, so I had to do a little bit of grinding on the bracket to get this to fit down in there, but no problem. I just got my four inch angle grinder and took a little chunk of the bracket off, and then I can put that 3G right down in there. I had to add a plug to it. Uh, the One of the plugs on the 2G will plug right into the 3G, and there's another little plug. Uh, you got the three, the 2G comes with a regular regulator plug, we call it the D-shaped plug. Then it's got a power plug to it. The power plug has two big wires towards the outside, on each outside and then a smaller wire in the center you have to cut that power plug off and add ring terminals on and put on a battery post. The 3G's got a battery post on the back. Uh, 2G's a terrible alternator upgrade. You don't, just don't want to upgrade that alternator. It's better to go to 3G. And we can supply you with that little bitty plug that goes uh, when you cut that power plug off you put the ring terminals on two of the bigger wires and then the littler center wire you put this little it's about a quarter inch square plug that plugs into the 3G and we can supply that. But boy, this has been at least four years. I am so happy with this Altenair. Everything works so good and this is a fine old truck. It's it's old, but it, uh, God, it doesn't matter how cold it is, this thing will start right up. It, it, I've had at times where my my Jimmy won't start up in the cold and, or has trouble. And I'll go out and this thing can set for weeks. I go out and try it, it just starts right up. I just love it. And it plows like crazy. It, just just does a super super good job the heater works really good in it uh, so we've got this I'm gonna put a link in the description below uh, taking you right to the 3g page so you can check this out give me a call to let me know we also have them for GM vehicles uh, the GM vehicles have a, a 105 amp alternator standard on a lot of them and it just doesn't work out well and we can upgrade that as well. We've got a, a, the AD 244 that we can do it. Uh, either the AD 244 or the CS 144. But we've had all kinds of snow here in Michigan. As I said, it's, I think it's about uh, four or five degrees right now. We've got snow up to our yin yang out here right now. So if you want the best, uh, let us get you set up uh, with that 3G series alternator. And uh, on that Ford, it's got the Ford V8. We can do them on the diesels or anything. Just uh, give me a call. Uh, there will be a phone number in the description below and plus a link to our site to look at these just different alternators. We know what we're doing because we're snowplow people. So give it a, give it a call and check it out. Thank you.